So in this video, what I wanted to do was create this interesting architectural building with uh, basically multiple floors, an outside storefront type of look, and then some circulation on the outside, and then also a pitch roof here at the top. And so what this script allows us to do is to take, let's say, um, all of those, let's see here, we have all the series of floors. So we can increase the number of floors, let's say five, and everything will kind of adjust according to that. We also have the ability to come here and check out the, the grid. So we have the extents of three by three, and that's the bay that you see here. So we have here the first, second, third bay, and that's what we have um, as the way to expand the building in either the X or Y direction. And so that's this here. And we have the beam height, we have the column width, and these are all parameters that we could adjust. Uh, and so yeah that's basically what I wanted to share with you guys it is a little bit of a complicated script but if you do want me to go over all the steps and you want me to uh, share with you guys uh, kind of my method of creating like architecture with parametric uh, tools then make sure to let me know because I will I will uh, create like a more in-depth tutorial if you guys are interested in it so I will go now into a time-lapse and share with you guys kind of the process of doing it and then at the end there there will be a rendering showing the final results so uh, stay tuned and if you have any questions uh, put them in the comments below um, and also make sure to check out the links below because there's other tutorials uh, on other websites so uh, thank you for watching
if you wanted to check out some more in-depth tutorials, I have a Udemy and a Skillshare website where, you know, I go over the steps in a little bit more detail. If you like the content, make sure to like the video. And if you want to see videos like this in the future, make sure to subscribe. Thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you next time.